Welcome one and all to UDJ's Halloween Special 2019. Instead of doing what I normally did for the past couple years and did a whole bunch of one-shots, I'm going to do one big long series. This is Deathmark. Went ahead and picked it up for the Vita and it was so good I decided this has got to be my Halloween Special. I had a lot of fun playing it and I hope, think, I hope that you guys have fun too. So I brought the disco with me and we're just going to go through Deathmark. Are you ready? Sure, Mark. This is gonna, this is gonna be spooky. This is gonna be scary spooky. Okay. Like, like, really scary. So, right. let's get scared. Data could not be found. Scared yet? Holy crap, an auto feature. Oh, there is an auto feature. Well, then, there we go. <laughs> Except it goes really slow. It's going pretty good. That's, that's me doing this. Well, you're a speed reader. I am. Miss Yamaguchi with the big glasses has gone missing. Oh, really? Well, that's weird. This song has got me, like, this is definitely Super Nintendo horror games. Clock tower type shit. I can see it. Ugh. She left her arm there? Yeesh. Cool. I like it already. Well, that's one way to get you hooked into a horror. Just to uh, have someone's disembodied arm in the library. Huh. Uh-oh. That's my sister. Oh. So it's this scar going around that's killing people. Is that it? Hmm. hmm. The mark of death. Why would it be called? Oh, it's called death mark. Yeah, okay. Why couldn't it be called like death gym or something like that? Death Bob. This is us. Look at that nice little mark we have on our arm. Uh oh. This is our character. Uh, this is like Phoenix Wright's words. These blue, uh, th this blue text means that he's thinking this, just like Phoenix Wright. Or pretty much any visual novel, whether it be italicized or a different color. Ah. Think about the death mark is that it hurts a lot. So much so that we got knocked out and ended up here. Yeah, I was with this big house here. Where the fuck did my watch go? Somebody stole my watch. Where did my coat go? Welcome to Devil Deathmark Incorporated. Sayakujo, spirit healer. Alright, so we're here to go see Sayakujo. Hmm. So this is Kujo Mansion, home of Sayakujo, who's apparently going to help with probably the mark we have on our hand. Charming place. Very charming. Probably looks better in the dark. I would raise a three-year-old child here. I would raise my mark of death here. Yeah, that looks pretty ow. Hmm. Yeah, that doesn't look uh doesn't look very inviting. Oh. Somebody is home. Well, let's head on inside. 
Hello? Anybody home? And then we are greeted with Lurch. I've got this regretful tattoo on me. Hi, I'm in a horror anime. Should I be dying now? Pools of blood everywhere. Trip down the stairs and somehow I disembowel myself. That didn't work. Anyone home, I think to myself. Anyone home? I should think that to myself. <laughs> well, up we go. Oh my god, gameplay. Right? Not yet. So there is gameplay in here. There is gameplay, but probably not in this episode. Okay. We'll get to gameplay in the next one, because this has more gameplay than you may think for a visual novel. Oh, hi there. Are you the spirit medium? Uh, what do you want to do? You can ignore him, talk to him, or reproach him. Mmm. Let's uh, talk to them. Uh, let's ignore him for now. But, well, then why'd you ask? It's a, it's a doll. I mean, why talk to him? It's like, hello! Well, what the fuck out. But I wanted to talk to it. Let's go see who's who's upstairs first. I don't want to, you know, I don't want them to come downstairs and see me talking to a you know, talking to a doll, saying, "How are you today?" Oh, I just came in here, you know, from wherever I came from, doing whatever I'm doing here. Do you know where my watch went? If I leave it ring, it'll be like twenty-seven o'clock. <laughs> uh, eh, we'll ignore that too. Just a clock. I mean, what's the big deal? Hmm. Still no reply. Let's make our way inside. Maybe they're making some tea or something like that. Or maybe, maybe they're in the bathroom or something like that. Or maybe they're dead. Oh. It's dark. It's, well, there was a, there was definitely a light on here. Yeah, there was so a light in here. Uh, let's see. Ah, uh, smells like a horror setup. Oh. Yeah. Ah. Hmm. What could it be? Oh. Oh yeah, the floor's gone too. Ah! It's the smell of blood. It's yep. Orange juice. Ah. Ooh, go right up into it. Come uh, on. We, we gotta stare at it. Oh, yeah! no! Oh, God, what happened to her? What the fuck? She got fucked the fuck. Oh, shit. Are those, like, sea anemone? <laughs> it's like her organs turned into flowers. But this... they smell very fragrant. Kind of. It's like, it's like vile plume turned into a xenomorph. <laughs> She's turning into a molded. Jeez. Yep, yep, I'm gonna puke. <laughs> well, that could have gone better. So much violent vomit that I just white out. I'm seeing things. No. That can't be a clicker. There's no way. Alright, so I'm hallucinating uh, weird deaths. And strange mangled corpses. Perfect. Where's that cyanide pill? I need, a, I need to see someone. So, um, what was that? Can I talk to the doll now? Oh, it's good. It officially uh, reached 27 o'clock. Go. <laughs> we got 92 hours in a day. They're very short. Ah! She is back here. Can I talk to you now? What now? 
Contact the police. I don't even know what the number is. <laughs> Nobody, no crime, right? You know, I was just about to joke about that. Oh, she speaks fluent Japanese. Oh, she talks, yeah. Might as well say that, too. At least she's friendly. Yeah. A little neutral, but, you know, that's kind of how dolls are. Remember playing doll from Bloodborne? Sup, doll face? Ha, ha, ha. Please play with me. This is Mary! She's going to be acting as kind of our guide throughout the game. Oh, really? Yeah. Sayakujo, the woman we probably saw... Is dead. Is dead. So now... Believe it or not, all they have is us now. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. Because we were brought here because of this mark. This mark brought us here. But we were, were we invited? I mean... Hmm... My name. My name is... Huh? Uh... Who? Protagonist Coon. My name is Hyperventilation. My name is Asphyxiation! Oh. This is what the mark does. It's a nobody. It stole a word. It gives you amnesia. How convenient. How convenient. So let's just think of a name for now, just so that we're not just called Protagonist Coon. Oh, okay. We'll, call, we'll be called Nobuo Coon and make it a giant <laughs> visual novel cinematic universe. Better have some placeholder name and continue his life as a hollow, nameless being. Jesus. Well, first, uh, let's pr let's enter the last name. Uh, Kuhn. Yashiki, uh, Kuhn. I got a better idea for that. I made myself laugh earlier. <laughs> and then his first name. Slim. We are the real Slim Shady. Sure. Can I do this? Uh, uh, yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Real! Yeah! Real! Oh, no way! <laughs> Is there a part where they tell me to stand up? Yes! The real! The real Slim Shady! <laughs> Hell yes. yeah! Now we can choose what we look like. Oh, we get really? glasses of beard, a uh, beard, glasses, or nothing. Wait, this is, like... Isn't this a first-person game? Who cares? It doesn't really matter that much. It's, oh, okay. it's, it's just kind of to put you in the game a bit more. And I think there's like one or two things that uh, that show up. But oh, okay. I have a beard. I have glasses. We're going glasses and beard. You are so dead. <laughs> you stole the real Slim Shady. I'm the real Slim Shady. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> That's stuck on my Switch for a while. Understood, <laughs> Lord Slim Shady. <laughs> oh, no. Now, let's talk about what this mark actually is. Oh, hopefully I don't lose myself. <laughs> oh, okay. Seal of death. Those who have it will soon die. When? All well, might take days, might take hours. Oh, at 28 o'clock. I'm not afraid. I'm not <laughs> Take afraid. a stand. Everybody. Everybody! So cool, though. This immediately drew me into the game. Because I love artsy horror shit. 
Victims slowly lose their memories until the day they die and face death, all the while suffering from the terror of losing oneself. Lose yourself! Yeah, well, you know, yeah. Yeah, there we go. Yes. So because we really don't know a goddamn thing, that means that death is coming for us very, very soon. And we're gonna die in the morning. Death mark, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. So in the morning we died. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> Next thing I know, I'm dead. Ooh, wake up in the morning feel like P. Diddy. Wait, that's a dollar sign, huh? So I'm going to say this is, like, what? An hour later, maybe? A few hours later? Most likely. Not enough to be dawn yet? Oh, imagine that. We'll be dead by daylight. But if it's true, I'll be right pissed. I'm going to be so cross with those demons of death. Excuse me, Mary. <laughs> what does a doll do, anyway? <laughs> I mean, she can move her arms. Not but... morning. Not morning. So how do you feel? I feel terrible. You feel terrible? <laughs> Expected. So it's time to ask a question. What now? Panic! 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 There are only two paths. The first is to wait for death and just, you know, turn the game off and die. And the second is to fight. Fight the and play, mark. And play the game. Fight Mark. <gasps> so there's a way to beat the mark. But, but she died she... before she could figure out a way to beat the mark. Before she could beat the mark. Yes. So she found a way to beat the mark, but died because she found a way to beat the mark. Or maybe she was close to finding a way to beat it, but not quite. Hmm. So now, maybe our only chance is to pick up where Saya left off and find a way to beat the mark. Because a lot of people have the mark, actually. Quite a few people. Seriously. So what are we gonna do? Yeah, go to sleep for the night. Turns out the doll is the angel of death that gave us the mark in the first place. That's my hot take. <laughs> and now to check your face to make sure if I called it or not. Uh, nope, didn't call a thing. Nope, not a goddamn thing. So now we're going to get to another part of uh, death mark. We've got things called life or death decisions. Ooh, I like it already. You've got a limited amount of time to make a multiple choice question, and if you make the wrong choices, you die. Live huh. or die. Interesting. This is a pretty easy question, so we're gonna talk about uh, Mary's question. Here. Are you the real Slim Shady? This is called Deadly Choice. If we do things wrong, we can lose soul power, which is kind of like our time slash health, and if that goes up, that goes down to zero, or we do a really wrong answer, we die. Okay. To bring it back. So to get soul power, we can complete a deadly choice, which will restore some soul power, and there's also a specific item that we can get when we're in the actual thick of the game, and um, that'll get us some soul power too. So we got the log button too, so it's giving us all this stuff. Auto mode, I'm not doing auto mode because I can press A. Hide the window by pressing X, yes, yes, yes. That's cool. We've played visual novels before. Easy way to get thumbnails. So, I ask you, will you quietly wait for death or struggle against the mark? Let's die. Okay, we'll wait for death. <laughs> Wrong answer! Then you meekly accept your death by the mark? Ah. Okay. So, basically, you're fighting against the clock in order to get the yeah. multiple choice. But see how quick right. it goes. That's, that's, that, that, that goes that's going fast. so much faster! No shit. So, no, we'll fight. Now, for the record, when we get to the actual life or death questions, I might go so fast, you might not be able to read everything. But that's okay, 
I'm go I'm gonna take you guys down the safest path. If you get scared, you stick with good old Uncle UDJ, and he's gonna take you through everything no problem. Don't do it. He doesn't even know his real name. This goes here too. You can hold his hand if uh, if if you get scared. No, I'll be fine. I know you'll be fine. It's for the audience. Oh, okay. As you say, Lord Slim Shady. <laughs> I can't wait to hear your Marshall Mathers LP. So we gotta fight the mark, but how do we fight the mark? We gotta fight ghosts or something? I don't know. The. But hey, we can't do this shit alone. Now, other characters are coming into the game. Oh, they got the card too. Yep. Well, now we have to explain this stuff to them. I would, but, you know, I'm a fucking doll. Welcome, everybody, to the Scary Mansion. By the way, this is the talking doll. Can I use you as a ventriloquist doll? I swear to God, if there's a talking bear that's two colors in here... How about a high school student? No, that and matches. An, an elementary school student. Oh, you're so dead. These kids have the mark. She can't come to the phone right now. She's dead. I'm... Whatever. Yeah, we'll go with that. You know, I bet Saya would heal your soul power if she was still alive. This is Moe Watanabe. She's an occult-loving high school student. Perfect. I don't know if that's oop arts or ooh parts. So people, so people who have the mark come to Kujo Mansion and will heal your spirit and get the mark out. But, well, the person who does that is now dead. She's, she's got uh, a death mark on her right thigh. That's the scary part, Moy. You never had any friends. She forgot she didn't have any friends. This is uh, one of those snot-nosed little brats who thinks they know everything. This is Sukasa, And yet, little boy, you have the mark. Here you are. Yeah, get owned, you fucking first grader! Show me your mark. This is Mary. She's a doll. She talks. Never seen one that big before. You'd never been to a convention, have you? <laughs> Saw, that. Saw that coming. So you two die in the morning. And now you must answer this question. Do you want to die or no? I'll die. What? 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 Oh, well, okay. There goes the occult person. I think so. I don't remember. So I don't remember, like, where I even got my fucking mark, but they're not as far along as they are because they still know their names, so maybe they know where their mark came from, and she thinks that hers is a curse from Hanahiko. Hanahiko? Sounds like a shrine or a statue. What the fuck is... what's Hanahiko? Oh, Mary knows what that is. 
Oh, Ooh. it's just a local ghost. Oh, yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> ah, so Saya was nuts. So Saya was investigating Hanahiko. So, which means that Hanahiko could be related to the mark. Maybe he gave me my mark, too. <laughs> I'm so glad I thought of this name. Now I want Eminem to be in a Death Mark movie. So, time for... Chapter 1. Hanahiko. But we'll save that for next time on Death Mark.